welcome to the day's events. Open up our checklist here. The four-star checklist. Passenger briefing. Hey guys, we're going on a trip. Flaps are retracted. Trim's neutral. Seatbelts are fastened. Avionics are off. Master alternator switch on. And switch on. Any collision lights? And these on. Circuit breakers are checked. Car beat is off. Parking brake is set. Double check parking brake. Fuel on the fullest tank. Mixture is set up to rich. Time is required. Go on, open the corridor and turn on the fuel pump. Clear prop. Let's go. 800, 1200 RPM. Oil pressure and temperature. Look at the engine instruments, make sure everything's in the green. Everything looks good. After start checklist, avionics can come on. Lights is required. Set the radio. Transponder is screwed up. Transponder set to altitude. Circuit breakers are in. Mixture linked with taxi. Fuel pump can come off. Now we can get the ATIS. 118.05. 19R. Dew point 16. Altimeter 29 or 2. Arriving and departing runway 25. Visual approaches in use. Read back all runway assignments and hold short instructions. Advise on initial contact you have information mic. Oxnard 8 is information mic. 0051 Zulu. Wind 260 at 16. Visibility 10. Sky condition, clear. Temperature 19 or dew point 16. Altimeter 29 or 9 or 2. Clear and runway 25. Visual approaches in use. Read there back all runway assignments. Advise on initial contact. You have Stay information. Right, uh, Give me the wind. Oxnard Airport. 8 is information mic. 0051 Zulu. Wind 260 at 16. Visibility 10. Sky condition. Clear. Temperature 19 or. D.16, altimeter 29 or 9 or 2, arriving and departing runway 25, visual approaches in you. Okay, we have the ATIS mic, pretty good wind, but right down the pike basically, so that's perfect. Um, before we go do that, let's go ahead and pull up another checklist. ATIS is now noted. Taxi checklist, don't we need to do a run up. Parking brake is set, flight instruments. Santa Monica Tower, Citation River, 554 Bravo, holding short runway 21 at Alpha we'll 5, ready for, uh, ready for takeoff. 554 Bravo, Santa Monica Tower, runway 21, clear for takeoff. Barometer is set now. Clear for takeoff, runway 21, Citation 54 Bravo. Turn coordinator is level. HSI is aligned with a magnetic compass. BSI is set to zero. That looks good. Mixture as required, we'll keep it rich. Throttle up to 2000 RPM. Magneto check. Looks good. John Lane, clearance and delivery, November Garby. 647, Romeo Golf. Progressive VFR flight following to Foxtrot 7 Euro at 5500, where a pipe of water Golf, we have Alpha. Hand meter check. We're 647, Romeo Golf, John That's Lane, clearance on departure, flighting 080, maintain VFR at or below 3000, so advised. Departure frequency 128.1, squawk 56, correction, squawk 5467. I need to accept both. Flight heading zero eight zero at or below three thousand. Departure frequency one three eight point one. Squawk five four six seven six four seven Romeo Golf. Check your six four seven Romeo Golf. We're back correct. Station five five four Bravo. Contact departure. Departure citation five four Bravo. Okay. So we've got everything lined up here. That is tower one three four point nine or five. Yeah. Ground one two one point nine. Yep. Okay. Everything looks fine. One through on Charlie Alpha, Bowery Park. Uh, northeast Hangar Three. One through on Charlie Alpha, taxi uh, northeast Ripley, uh, Charlie. Cross my one five, right at one five, left at Charlie, and monitor ground. That's our ground. Cherokee one eight zero zero Tango. Is that the hangars looking for a vehicle departure to the west with Mike? One eight zero zero Tango, Oxnard ground, runway two five, taxi at Foxtrot Alpha. Foxtrot Alpha to two five, Cherokee one eight zero zero Tango. Station five five four Bravo, departure. The departure citation number 554 Bravo climbing uh, at 3000. Station 554 Bravo, so call departure radar contact, climb maintain uh, 5000, turn right heading 050, vector Santa Monica. Uh, vectors for Santa Monica and up to 5000. Remember Charlie, five, change my frequency 135.1. Say again, November, to November Charlie. Number 19, November Charlie, change my frequency 135.1.
135.1, Road again. I just can't wait to get on the road again. Palomar ground, Skyhawk 110, Papa Echo, Southwest Ramp, ready to taxi, requesting clearance to stay in pattern. With information uniform. Down the way, T4, taxi via Alpha. Taxi via Alpha, please. North approach, Baron, 982 November, Charlie, 10,500. Roger. Oh god, these rudders, man. John Wayne Ground, November 64, Sun Runway Golf at the East Transit Parking, ready to taxi with Alpha. Approaching runway 25. These rudders are nuts. Number 647, Romeo Golf, John Wayne Ground, runway 20, left to Kilo, taxi via Hotel, Charlie Kilo. Can I take off briefly? This is going to be a straight out departure, Kilo, most likely. Uh, once we take off, Bravo, clear track Santa Monica. We go look at the map. Clear track Santa Monica, 54 Bravo. At station 54 Bravo, contact SoCal approach 134.9. Left to right is ideal. We had a thousand feet, probably try and turn on that runway. Uh, on this runway, we have about six thousand feet. Number turn over five four one two. If we are on by, if we aren't off by, honestly, Bravo, we should probably re re undo our departure just because we should be off and probably under two thousand feet easy. I want to say, like Charlie, we would cancel, retard, and just stop on the runway. Anything after that, we're going to try and land. Or anything, but if we rotate before that, we'll before Charlie, we're going to try and land in front of us. After that, land within 20 degrees in front of us, give or take. Whatever feels right for the airplane, once we establish a flight. If we hit pattern altitude, which here would be about 1100, we can come back and land here, most likely. Busy night. Bravo, SoCal approach, Los Angeles style. Take off, reaching complete. Two. Doors, windows are secure. Flight controls. Bravo, Bravo. Free, incorrect. Fuel selector. We'll go ahead and switch that. Fuel pump on. Mixture is rich. Transponder is set to altitude. Flaps are retracted. Landing lights coming on. We'll note the clock. And uh, we'll switch over to tower. One, tower. We're at Alpha, right? Yeah. Box on our tower, Cherokee 1800 Tango, short at 25 at Alpha, ready for departure. 1800 Tango, Ox Tower, what was your direction of departure? Yeah, what was your direction of departure? West, sir. 1800 Tango, short departure approved, 25 clear for takeoff. Short departure approved, 25 clear for takeoff, Cherokee 00 Tango. Let's go, son. Approaching runway 25. Entered runway 25. 5,900 feet remaining. Perfect clearance, assess 46526 via our request. Go ahead. Uh, 46526, Nahawk Slant Golf, uh, request flight following Santa Barbara 6500 with Zulu. Let's go. 46526, okay. on departure, proceed on course, maintain the fire to blow 2500 until advised. Air speed is alive. 134.2, squawk 2720. Rotate. Uh, on departure, fly runway Rain heading uh, west, at or below 2500, 134.2, and squawk 2726. Four six five two six. I'm here for squawk two seven two zero. Uh, two seven two zero on squawk uh, two six. Thank you. Read back correct. Uh, five five four Bravo. Uh, where are you navigating to right now? Uh, Victor six four five four Bravo. Your instructions were to fly the, uh, to Santa Monica, then the Santa Monica one two five radial to then join Victor sixty four. You should you should be on the other side of uh, the east side of LA there on the other side of Victor sixty four, not down south of, uh, of uh, the Los Angeles VOR. 554 Bravo, turn left heading 110, Vector Zerker 64, you can join Vector 64 on that heading. Uh, uh, apologies, was that 110, Bravo? Affirmative. Alright, we're going to fly west straight out until we uh, get out of this guy's airspace, and then we'll go north until we hit the coastline and just follow that. We got a nice sunset view. Baron 918 November, Charlie, kind of Las Vegas, approach 125.9er. 125.9er, 982 November, Charlie. Cool game. Moving ground, Cessna 46526 at Millionaire, ready for taxi. 46526, uh, Burbank ground, runway 88 to taxi via Delta. Alright, so this guy's airspace is actually only up to 2,000. Up to and including. So once I'm above 2,000, I'm going to turn north. I had a 125 radio written down for that, my apologies. No longer in his airspace. So I'm going to turn north and we're just going to follow the coast over here. And we're going to climb up to 6,500. Maybe 4,500, it's a short flight. Skyhawk, 110, Papa Echo, radio check. Aircraft call for radio check, loud and clear. 541 Juliet Sierra, runway 30, clear to land. 30, clear to land, 541 Juliet Sierra. 
554 Bravo. Uh, just continue flying that heading. Fly heading. Uh, fly heading 110 now and contact SoCal approach 128.1. Don't join the airway. It's an airplane somewhere over here. Two eight point one. There he is. He's in sight. It's below us. We're in 92 November Charlie 10,500. 92 November Charlie Las Vegas approach. The Vegas altimeter 2993. 93 November Charlie. Charlie Tower in November 647 Romeo Golf, holding short, runway 20 left, 5 kilo, ready, forward departure. Number 647 Romeo Golf, John Wayne Tower, runway 20 left, a kilo, cliff takeoff. Runway 20 left, 5 kilo, cliff takeoff, 7 Romeo Golf. First citation, number 554 Bravo, 5000. Is he 9? Station 554 Bravo, SoCal approach the John Wayne altimeter 291, Bravo is current, expect vectors visual, start to lean on mixture right. here. Look at the UGT in the top left, and, and we will start to arrive. As we lean. Which is okay. We're hoping to get a little bit extra power. All right, we're way past our after takeoff checklist point. Flaps are up. Fuel pump. We can turn off. Lights. Lane light type light no longer required. Once we hit 4,500, I'll throw away in our cruise. Right to the sun. Number eight tower. Cessna one two Sierra Alpha and Alpha. Number one Juliet Sierra. Tax park via Alpha. Minutes for quickly. The Alpha. Your frequency one two two. 554 five, Bravo, turn left heading 080. Vectors visual approach 20 right, descend to maintain 3000. Just trim here. Up to 080, oh, 3000, and then uh, visual 20 right, citation 5 Bravo. 647 Romeo Golf, radar contact, contact SoCal departure 128.1. 128.17 Romeo Golf. My autopilot's not working, so I guess I'm just going to have to do this the hard way and actually trim the airplane myself. Oh no. Settle back a little bit. A uh, decent cruise. Okay, so it actually is working, it's just the lights aren't turning on. So like if I did this, the heading should hold that heading. Which I think has happened. Alright, now we can just sightsee a little bit. Look at this. And I wish it was just a little bit later. I bet Talk this will look amazing. November 647 Romeo Golf heading 8080 uh, 1800. 647 Romeo Golf, SoCal departure, resume on navigation, resume appropriate VFR altitude. Resume all navigation, resume appropriate VFR altitude, 7 Romeo Golf. So here's a track right now, going more or less exactly where I want to go. Maybe turn. So that's Citation 54 Bravo, it's got the airport in sight. Station 54 Bravo, cleared visual approach, runway 20 right, contact John Wayne Tower, 126.8. Visual 20 right, and over to Tower 26.8, Citation 54 Bravo. We can do while we wait. Head on over to the plates. Go over to Santa Barbara. Look up its frequencies. So ADIS is 132.65. That tuned in. And then we can go in Santa Barbara Tower, 900.7. Alamar Tower, Skyhawk 110, Papa Echo, reporting left base, runway 24. Skyhawk 110, Papa Echo, please give me a call midfield left down at each time, runway 24, clear for the option. And you should be squawking normal. You're not squawking. No, you're not. Trans your transponder is not turned on. Skyhawk 110 Papa Echo, affirmative. Joint Tower Citation Order 5 for Bravo is 8 miles to the northwest inbound from visual 2 0 right. 110 Papa Echo, I need you to read back your land, your uh, your option clearance. I need you to turn your transponder on. Just reading back affirmative isn't is, isn't going to cut it. Oh. <laughs> yeah. If he says affirmative again. <laughs> November 110 Papa Echo, Palomar Tower. I figure if your transponder is not working, just turn off your radio. <laughs> 554 Bravo, John Wayne Tower, runway 20 right, clear to land. Clear land, 20 right, 54 Bravo. Number Cessna 46526, holding short runway 8, ready for departure. 46526, Burbank Tower, runway 8, clear for takeoff, proceed on course. Take off on course, 526. 1 5 left, visual approaches in use. The FR departures contact clearance delivery. Advise on course heading, altitude, and if flight following is requested, read back all runway assignments and hold short instructions. Advise on initial contact you have information at ray. Santa Barbara Municipal Airport, 8 is information X ray. 0153 Zulu. Wind 110 at 5. Visibility 9 or sky condition. Clear. Temperature 22. Dew point 16. Altimeter 29 or Arriving and departing runway 25, 15 right, 15 left. Visual approaches in use. 
V, FR departures, contact clearance delivery, advise on course heading, altitude, and if flight following is requested, read back all runway assignments and hold short instructions. Advise initial contact, you have information x-ray. I thought it was, they said 1-5 left the first Santa time I heard Barbara that. Santa Barbara Municipal Airport, 8 is information x-ray, 0153 Zulu, wind 110 at 5, visibility 9R, sky condition, clear, temperature 22, dew point 16, altimeter 29R89, arriving and diverting runways 25, 15 right, 15 left, visual uh. approaches in use. The FR departures, contact clearance, delivery, advise on course heading. I did, they're using multiple, which is fine. All right, we have x-ray. Depends 1105. Yeah, both of those runways are fine, so we'll just see which one he gives us. 46526, x-ray, our contact, contact departure. Over to departure, 526. All right, so this uh, class Charlie goes up to 4,000. So at 4,500. ground, good evening. Uh, Cessna 7815 Delta set. Uh, I would like to pick up the line off far to Chino using custom weather information to it. Destination ADIS is 13.65. Delta Riverside ground, to Chino Airport, the Riverside to departure, Paradise VOR, and then direct. I maintain 4,000. Departure frequency 35.4 and squawk 5332. Clear to the uh, Chino Airport, Riverside to departure, Paradise, uh, then direct. Comment in 4000, March 3C 135.4, Spock 5332, Skyhawk uh, 7815 Delta. Skyhawk 7815 Delta, about correct? Yeah, I mean, we're still 20 miles out, probably. Departure Cessna 46526, 2600, climbing 6500. Just get a little bit closer. 46526, SoCal approach, the Burbank altimeter 2991. 2991, 526. Ecoresume appropriate via altitude. Same via far altitude, six. What the hell is this place called? So Santa Barbara? Yeah, Santa Barbara. I just realized I'm still calling this test screen. That might help a little. Okay, I'm going to remember Charlie, Conk Los Angeles Center, 134.65. 18 miles. 134.65. Alright, let's do it. Santa Barbara Tower, Cherokee, 180010 Tango is about 17 miles east, inbound full stop with X ray. It's Class Charlie Airport, so you got a call approach first. You do? I didn't know that. Oh, sure shit, it sure does. Fair 92 November Charlie, Los Angeles Center, the Indian Springs, altimeter 2998. A 647 runway at the radar services terminated, squawk and maintain VFR, fixed changes approved. Yeah, you approve. 7 runway at all. San Luis Ground, Cirrus 810, Romeo Tango at East Tango's requesting taxi. This is for my Cap 4 radio. 810 Romeo Tango, San Luis Ground, runway 29 or taxi via Alpha, and what is your direction of departure? Uh, I am going to depart left downwind towards Santa Maria. Cirrus 810 Romeo Tango. Need you to read back your taxi instructions and verify so you're a southeast departure for the direction? Alright, southeast departure for the direction, taxi to runway 29 via Alpha, Cirrus 810 Romeo Tango. Station 554 Bravo, taxi front can be a Bravo, monitor ground. Fucking Bravo, Santa Barbara approach, Cherokee 1800 Tango, VFR request. Go ahead. Cherokee 1800 Tango is about uh, 16 miles to the east of Santa Barbara Airport, looking for uh, look, looking for entrance in the class Charlie to land. 1800 Tango, Squawk 4711 Ident, verify type aircraft. 4711 Ident, type aircraft, PA 28 Cherokee. Not sure. Intercept ground, uh, Cessna 7815 Delta, near the uh, Echo intersection, ready for taxi, Zulu. 7815 Delta, Riverside ground, runway 27, taxi via Alpha Charlie. 27 via Alpha Charlie, Cessna 7815 Delta. 1800 Tango, radar contact, one four miles east of Santa Barbara, Santa Barbara, altimeter 29089, our information X ray current. 29089, I have X ray. Let's see how this works. 1800 Tango, traffic, nah, 3 o'clock, 3 miles, eastbound, via Falls Gates 5500, type unknown. Looking for traffic, 0 zero tank. Ooh, it's blinding. Do you see him? I don't see him. I'm gonna start turning west since I'm technically above the Charlie. It's been a long time since I've flown into a Charlie. This is good. I thought that you could just reach out to the tower. I was wrong. I gotta do a little jaunt there. Probably didn't have to. Again, I'm above the Charlie technically. But, uh, 
since I forgot the contact approach, I figured it best to give me some time. From Sky Tower, Cessna 715 Delta, holding short only 27 at Charlie, waiting IFR release. 715 Delta, Riverside Tower, I have your release, advisory for departure. Uh, ready for departure, uh, Cessna 715 Delta. 7815 Delta, Riverside Tower, wind 26012, runway 27, clear for takeoff. Runway 27, clear for takeoff, uh, Cessna 7815 Delta, I think. Santa Barbara approach, Cherokee 1800 Tango, dumb question. Stand by. 1800 Tango, go ahead. Do I need two way communications with approach or two way communications with tower before they enter the Charlie? Uh, technically, approach. Um, uh, yeah, approach, approach, because you need to contact approach uh, ideally within 20 miles of a Class C airport. Got it, thank you, sir. Oh, it's not with the tower. 1800 Tango, you can contact Santa Barbara Tower, 119.7. Over tower, 119.7, 00 Tango. Alright, how far out am I? Santa Barbara Tower, Cherokee 1800 Tango, uh, 4,500 descending about 10 miles to the southeast of the airport and bound full stop X-ray. Cherokee 1800 Tango, Santa Barbara Tower, make straight in runway 25, report 3 mile final. Straight in 25, we'll report 3 mile final, 00 Tango. Scott, 15 Delta, connect departure. Departure 15 Delta. So call departure, good evening, uh, Cessna 7815 Delta, 1,800, uh, climbing 4,000, uh, Riverside 2 departure. 715 Delta, send out departure radar contact, climb maintain 4,000. Let me know you have the weather for Chino and what your approach request is. Oh, climb maintain 4,000, and uh, we'd like to hold us published uh, for a couple circuits uh, uh, at Paradise if possible for uh, 7815 Delta. 7815 Delta, expect further clearance 0245 Zulu times 0225 and a half. Let me know when you're ready to leave the hold. All right, uh, 0245 Zulu, we'll expect further clearance, and then uh, we'll let you know uh, when we're ready uh, for 7815 Delta. All right, down we go. Traveling clearance of 14008, requesting destination for I-4 waiting at ground. 14008, traveling clearance, follow flight plane to Santa Monica for me. Sierra, Mike, and Oscar, give me a call and you're ready to pick up your clearance. Ground in there, 121.7. Stop flight plan for Santa Monica, Sierra, Mike, Oscar, 008, thank you. Alert, terrain ahead. Four landing checklist is complete, we'll do it again. Mixture is rich, lights are on, gear is down and welded. Level off here on 1500. About to make a call that we're on a three mile final. Or wait, two five. In the Barber Tower, Cherokee 1800 Tango, three mile final, two five. 1800 Tango, runway two five, clear to land. Clear to land, two five, zero zero Tango. Oh boy. That uh, sunset <laughs> does not make it easy to land. Uh, I think we're probably high, so we want to get down to pattern altitude, which will be about 1100. I see the runway lights. I think I'm actually to the left of the runway. Thankfully, those things are blinking at me. I don't know if you can see him in the stream, but I can see him in front of me. We're inside the wide arc, we go one notch flaps. Over the winds, 1105. So they're coming from the left, but not very serious. Oh yeah, we're definitely left of the uh, runway there, and we're high. Yep. And we could just now really see it clearly. That sunset is really, really screwing this up. Go flaps two. One mile final runway two five. Are we landing again? The FBO. On the south side of the airport. 500. Ordered it. Bounced it. <laughs> Slammed it. <laughs> oh man. Traveling clearance is the 14008 at the north one. Requesting I for clearance to Santa right, Monica. With Cherokee 00 zero Tango, where do you park? Uh, parking at the uh, FBO on the south side of the airport. Cherokee 1800 Tango, taxi to Atlantic Aviation via Alpha, Mike, Echo. Cross my 15 right at Mike, cross my 15 left at Echo, monitor ground. Alright, taxi to Atlantic Aviation via Alpha, Mike, Echo, cross 15 right at Echo, cross 15 left at Echo, monitor ground, 00 Tango. Number 918 November Charlie, radar service is terminated, squawk and maintain VFR, frequency changes approved. Flaps are coming up. After landing checklist, flaps are up. Mixture as required, landing lights can come off, fuel pump can come off. So people can see where the heck I'm going and clear to cross. Why well, yeah, turn right, but then clear to cross. We've been clear to cross. Approaching runway 15 right, 33 left. left. Check right. Entered runway 15 right, 33 good. left. Turned on our lights. Keep double checking our finals. Approaching runway 15 left, 33 right. Entered good. runway 15 left, 33 right. All right, we're just going to park to the left of this TPM over here. Probably call it a night. That was embarrassing enough for me. Checklist. Parking's checklist. Avionics off. 
lights off. Problems retarded. Mixture cut off. Master switch off the ignition. That's it. All right, that's all for my flight today. Slowly expanding my experience in flying in Pilot Edge. So we went from taking off at a Delta and landing back at a Delta to taking off from a Delta, landing at a Charlie, and screwing it up. Kind of. I mean, it wasn't a big deal, but, you know, screwed it up. Remembered something. I've flown into Bravos, and I've flown into Deltas. Haven't ever flown into a Charlie real life. I think in reality, what this teaches me is that doing cross countries into controlled airspace, just get flight following. Because that'll help you with these things. If you have flight following, you still need to make sure you don't bust Bravos <laughs> um, or any airspace for that matter. Um, but they got your back at least a little bit to help you with those things. Anyway, thanks for watching. Do this again next week. Uh, pay attention to my TikTok or YouTube for more entertaining clips of this. Later, y'all.